Greetings, models. I am the Fallen Shogun, and welcome to the Cat Cafe. This is a cat cafe. This little dudette running around. So I don't know if they're male or female anymore. I think they're called Kitty. It is me, and this is your Cat Cafe. So I've played for five in-game days just to have a figure of what is going on. Some stray cats are looking for food. So right now I have one staff member. Obviously things are going on. Why aren't you doing your job? Uh oh. Okay, there we go. Okay, there we go. So why aren't they doing their job? There we go. So the game is all about running a cat cafe. There are different people you can talk to. Different things you can do. Each... Different group requires different things. I guess my staff I see there's Kitten, which is me. That was the default name. I didn't choose it. There's Zoe. Different skills and abilities. There's the cats who come around. I have two cats right now. To get more cats, I have to tempt them. As you can see, what happens is you put some food down. Then you pet the one you want. Each one has different abilities. This one likes business people. It's better with vagabonds. This one is better with witches. Yes, witches are a thing. There we go. So I'm going to stroke it one more time and I get myself a third cat. Skip to morning. Now a different group. The vagabonds, punks, business people, business person, uh, artists and witches and so on. And each one of you likes different things. It gives you different amount of resources. Each group gives you different resources of which you need. Now in the advertising wise, you choose which ones arrive. This one here. See, vagabonds need water. They pay with fabrics. Business people need black coffee. Pay with gold. Fisher folk require black tea, pay with fish. I don't think I have access to black tea yet. Artists, black coffee, pay with jewels. And these need herbal tea, pay with materials. So obviously each group requires different things, and there's loads, loads of different currencies up top. And to get new stuff, you buy furniture here. See, this requires these, which are jewels. So, but hipster bookshelf requires golden jewels. So there's many, many different things you can buy and use. So it's a little bit confusing in that respect. Let's see, I'm going to buy the black tea recipe. Then I can actually buy tea. What do I need for black tea? I think I need tea leaves. I can't afford any more. As you can see my ingredients here, I've got seven bread left and 15 coffee beans. Once that is out, I'm in trouble. I'll have to buy more. So I can also buy pet goods. These are the pet goods you need. I need the fisherman for that one. So I can get more little kitties. More kitties means more happiness. More happiness means more people giving me more things. It's a balancing act. Now you can... That was cute. Expand. You can decorate. You can expand. As you can see, you buy stuff. I don't really have anything, but I can if need be expand out. Which wood is also a resource. I don't have much of it, but it is in fact a resource. You can slowly grow and expand as time goes by. There's also a kind of research tree. When you go to the witches. Yes, the witches. Now, as you get happiness, you unlock things. I unlocked staff. As you can see here, I need 350 happiness to get more staff. This gives me more chairs, more chairs, more people. And this is all the basic hipster stuff. So you need to get more happiness. Happiness, of course, is gained from... Getting the items they want first, they have a main preference and a second day preference. And of course, making sure they're happy with the cats. We need more cats. Oh. Hi, thanks for calling me right away. Yay! So more cats, more things, obviously, but then more food. I need to feed some. Come with me, little kitty, and I'll show you happiness. Adopt! Come here, Brian. I have a third cat now. Perfect. And you can level them up as time goes by. Everything gets leveled up. You have like little cat training skills. Let's give Brian this. Let's make you uh, train and happier for witches. There we go. So now I have a third cat. Oh, look at you. Ain't you so adorable? Oh. Uh, but I am going to be running out of resources very, very soon. Very, very soon. So I need to buy more. So uh, it's a bit of a balancing act here and there. That's fine. Let's buy some more bread. Can't buy anything else. I need the blue resource for that. The big issue you will have, of course, again, is the huge, huge number of different resources you need. At the beginning, you will get overwhelmed. 
But of course, you don't really need too much. You don't need the second person. You can do it all yourself. It's just managing and slowly going insane. I actually quite like it. It's a very cute little idea, little cute little design decision. I obviously need more chairs and things. I also need some more regular chairs. I have all the different chair types. Okay, they're doing that's going well. We need more nectar. Nectar, I think, is from witches. Yes, I need witches to come. Which means I might need more chairs. More. Okay, we visited. Carla Lina's important, but we're, okay. Bye bye. So, get need to get more witches. I'm getting all the other resources. Which one gives me materials? Oh, I've unlocked the cat litter box. Now I want cold brew coffee. That reminds me. Two more cats. Two more cats. Black tea requires tea leaves. I know it requires tea leaves. I need more nectar for that. Witches need pretzels. I forgot. So, yeah, it's. Okay, punks require herbal tea, they give materials. Materials need to expand. And that's the game. Starts off slowly insane, gets steadily worse, or better as time goes by. Two hot to your cafe. Plus two gamer cat won't stop playing. Plus one punks. Let's go for two hot. You're an arty cat, aren't you, Brian? Yeah, you are. I may have to kick people out. Also, I'm pretty sure some of the sound effects they're using remind me very much of The Sims. They either are The Sims or from the, or just Sims-like. But, yeah. Until you start expanding, there isn't too much to look at. Kitten, that is me. I want me to be better at cleaning. Thank you. Zoe, I'd like for you to be better at service. Zoe, I hired. Zoe is special. Now, you can put new things on the menu. Like black tea, I can't. Well, black, yeah, black tea, I can't do anything with. As you can see, witches like it, artists like it. But if you don't have anything, you can just take it off the board. But we are very low on the resources. We need the tea leaves. We need witches to like us, but they don't. Witches never like us. Basic fridge, yes, yeah, sure. Coffee machine, big sink. Yes. Give me everything. My cafe must look the best. That's a bigger sink. There we go. There we go. Slowly expanding make my place look better. Although the sink's definitely seen better days. Definitely seen better days. Oh, ain't you guys so cute. Oh, Ezra. Oh, I love cat cafes. There isn't one in my area. I wish there was. Cats are adorable. Yeah, you are. If you don't like them, they leave and find someone else. Like mine may have done. We don't know. But which is odd coming here. So apart from this, what else is there to the game? Obviously the very beginning is just finding and meeting people. Not rank C. Just finding and meeting people. Because each and every shop is run by a different personality. Obviously there's different personalities in charge of each of the groups too. That's it, do your job. There we go. And just straight ticks on. Eventually you won't really need to do anything yourself. I can, if need be, talk to people. It doesn't matter who takes the order or who has the drink. As long as one of you has picked up a drink, every one of your staff members has the drink. That's pretty easy. Uh -huh, uh -huh. I'm mocking you. That's actually quite a lot of space, as you can see here. There's a lot of space to expand your cat cafe. Eventually this whole area will be cats and cafe. But right now it's six badly matched chairs and three cats crapping on the floor. Yeah, I'm watching you. I'm watching you. What's well, a witch finally? Luckily water's always free, but only vagabonds require that. And that doesn't really help me in the grand scheme of things. Maybe I should have gone for more chairs, but there's no real place to put them. Let's get another table. The place is filling up and it's filling up fast. Give me what I want. Oh my god. I just care as I'm growing and expanding. Yeah. Yeah, I need more witches. Just come to my cafe. 
All the wishes get all of the things. Give me all the stuff. There we are. Slow growing. Oh, plus 29. Slow growing insanity. Now with that done, I can now buy probably more bread at this rate. Uh, I need more beans. But if I get the beans, I can't afford the tea leaves. So unless you get the right people, you can obviously stop the rest coming. So you only get a certain type. You will be a little bit behind. I think we're doing okay. The witches seem happier. The world seems calmer. And I now have access to more cats. Which is great. Let's get some more chairs. There we are. You need food? Oh no. There you go. Eat all the food. Who's a good kitty? Here you are. I can't... There's a cat sleeping in pee. I can't clean this up. There we go. There we go. Got it. And now we can finally... Finally... Buy... Tea leaves. Wait, which one did I get? Black tea. They get the herbal tea, got the black tea. Of course I did. So we get the fisherman at least, so that means, you know, more stuff. <laughs> Apart from that, I'm not sure what else there is to it. Like, I'm trying to make things exciting. It is fun. It is fun, but there isn't too much else. Like, I can't go out my way and say this is amazing, this is awesome. It's, yeah, I think I've shown you most of what the game currently is. It does slow build as time goes by, but there isn't really much else to show. Hi. There really isn't much else to show at all. Just slowly growing expansion. I was expecting a little bit more because I completed the tutorial and all that, but no, there isn't. There isn't at all. A slow growth, slow expansion, and more and more cats in my... What is basically a shack. In the middle of nowhere, surrounded by more light from my street has, I've just noticed. Full of witches. Suspicious, suspicious witches. And there you go. This is Cat Cafe. It's fun. It's interesting. There really isn't... Much else I can say. I've shown you everything. Oh, and now I've literally shown you everything. It's ended. But yeah, Cat Cafe Manager. Uh, demo I'm playing right now. Uh, link in the description downstairs below. Demo's probably over by the time I release this. Take care. Be awesome. Be epic. Be amazing. And I'll be seeing you sometime soon. Take care.